I would absolutely love if you would subscribe to this channel. So click the little subscribe button and you will be notified of all of the rankings, interviews, recaps, and previews. We'll finish up really quickly with rapid fire questions. Okay, great. Okay. What is the last show you binge watched? Ooh, I'm watching Only Murders in the Building right now. What did I watch before that? I watch a lot of HGTV, a lot of Fixer Upper. I'm sorry, I'm bad at rapid fire. <laughs> no, you're I want to watch The Crown. The Crown is next. Okay, you got to add The Crown to your list. I watched the first couple seasons. It's very good. Then, of course, you get distracted by so many other shows out there, but I'm sure you'll love it. <laughs> Right. We're into, so we're into the, sorry, again, this is, I'm ruining rapid fire, but we're <laughs> into the, the age of Princess Diana. So we're getting into, I believe we're like in the early nineties now where we've moved through mm -hmm. all of Elizabeth's life, which is wild. It is wild. It's crazy. It's well, iconic yeah. ladies. <laughs> I know. Right. For sure. So iconic. And then, um, what is your go-to holiday drink? You know what I really like this year? I have a frother and I've been making a London fog. Does that count? It's a warm drink. So it's, I have a London fog, but you can do like Earl Grey or English breakfast and, and do the tea. And then you add um, some frothed milk, maybe some honey, maybe some vanilla extract, maybe sprinkle some cinnamon on top. I like to put whipped cream on mine, <laughs> but I like tea. Oh, wow. That sounds amazing. I've never had anything quite like that. That is a great drink suggestion for anybody listening and watching. My goodness. Also, if you're at Starbucks, I really like the medicine ball, which isn't on the Starbucks menu, but they can make it. I had one today. It's so good. Wow. You got like the secret menu orders going. <laughs> I always order it and then I go, do you know what that is? And they do. They always know what it is, but it's not on the menu anywhere and you can't order it on the app, but they know. <laughs> they always know those baristas know how to make anything. That's so fun. I love it. And what is your favorite Christmas movie? It kind of trumps the Christmas category. It's sort of just the best movie of all time, but I love it's a wonderful life. I think it's so good. I think it captures the human spirit. And I think there's so much heart and humor and talk about a dynamic character. There's Jimmy Stewart for you. Um, yeah, I think it's timeless too. Absolutely timeless. A perfect choice. I completely agree. And then finally, what is your like go-to holiday food, either sweet or savory? I'm flying home to Nashville tomorrow and we were talking about snacks for <laughs> the watch party on Sunday. I was like, I really want pigs in a blanket. So I love pigs in a blanket, but my grandmother has this recipe for sausage rolls that's been in the family for a long time. And I do, I really associate these sausage rolls with, with Christmas. So mini mama's sausage rolls and pigs in a blanket. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds amazing. Thank you so much for chatting. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you for having me, Bessie. It's nice meeting you. It was nice meeting you as well. Bye. Bye. I would absolutely love if you would subscribe to this channel. So click the little subscribe button and you will be notified of all of the rankings interviews, recaps, and previews.